Good evening, and tonight we begin with a story that's deeply concerning for anyone who's considered cosmetic procedures. Nisatau Health has issued an urgent alert for clients of Fresh Cosmetic Clinic in Sydney. The clinic, which has now been ordered to close, is under investigation for serious infection control breaches. These breaches, as we'll discuss, could put clients at risk for dangerous blood-borne viruses. This is a story about public health, but it's also about trust. When we put our appearance and well-being in the hands of practitioners, we expect a certain standard of care. The allegations against Fresh Cosmetic Clinic, if true, represent a breach of that trust with potentially life-altering consequences. Over the next few minutes, we'll break down what happened, what the risks are, and what you need to know to protect yourself and your loved ones. This is a developing story, and we'll be sure to keep you updated as more information becomes available. But for now, let's be clear. If you've been a client at Fresh Cosmetic Clinic, it's absolutely critical that you seek medical advice and get tested for blood-borne viruses as soon as possible. Fresh Cosmetic Clinic, located in the heart of Sydney, offered a range of popular treatments. These included things like dermal fillers, anti-wrinkle injections, and even more invasive procedures like thread lifts. While these procedures can be safe when conducted properly, they also come with inherent risks. The concern here is that Fresh Cosmetic Clinic wasn't following the rules designed to keep clients safe. Nisafdala's health investigators uncovered a number of alarming issues. These included the use of unregistered practitioners, meaning individuals operating without proper qualifications. Adding to the concern, there were reports of expired medications being administered. Expired medications can be ineffective and, in some cases, even dangerous. These findings paint a disturbing picture of negligence and disregard for patient safety. It's important to remember that even seemingly simple cosmetic procedures can have serious complications if proper hygiene and protocols aren't followed. The use of needles and other invasive techniques creates a pathway for infections, particularly blood-borne viruses, to spread. These are not just minor oversights. We're talking about fundamental breaches of safety protocols that could have serious, lasting impacts on patients. We've been talking about the risk of blood-borne viruses, but what does that actually mean? These viruses, as the name suggests, are transmitted through contact with infected blood. In the context of a clinic like this, that could happen through the reuse of needles, improper sterilization of equipment, or even contact with contaminated surfaces. Some of the most well-known blood-borne viruses include hepatitis B, hepatitis C, and HIV. These viruses can cause serious, even life-threatening illnesses. What's particularly concerning is that these viruses can be silent invaders, meaning they don't always cause immediate symptoms. You might be infected and not even know it, which is why getting tested is so important. Early detection is key. If you know you've been exposed or if you're experiencing any unusual symptoms, don't wait. Talk to your doctor immediately. Early detection can make a huge difference. If caught early, these infections are manageable and treatable, but you have to take that first step and get tested. So, what should you do if you've been a client at Fresh Cosmetic Clinic? The first and most important step is to contact your doctor or a local health clinic right away. They can advise you on the necessary tests for blood-borne viruses, including hepatitis B, hepatitis C and HIV. Remember, early detection is crucial. These viruses are treatable and early intervention can significantly improve outcomes. Don't feel ashamed or embarrassed to seek help. Your health is the priority. If you're feeling anxious or overwhelmed, 
there are resources available to support you. Lifeline is available 24-7 for crisis support and suicide prevention and you can reach them by dialing 13 11 14. It's really important to take action now. Don't wait. Your health and peace of mind are worth it. The situation at Fresh Cosmetic Clinic highlights a larger issue. The importance of being informed consumers especially when it comes to procedures that carry inherent risks. It's crucial to do your research before undergoing any cosmetic procedure, no matter how minor it may seem. Ask questions. Don't be afraid to ask about a clinic's infection control practices, the qualifications of their staff, and whether they use new sterile needles for every procedure. Your health and well-being are paramount and it's your right to have these questions answered. Remember, reputable clinics will welcome your inquiries and see them as a sign of a responsible client. If a clinic is evasive or dismissive of your concerns, it's best to look elsewhere. Hand section six, the power of awareness, speaking out and seeking help. The more we talk about these issues, the more we empower ourselves and others to make informed decisions. Sharing your story, if you feel comfortable doing so, can help raise awareness and potentially protect others from experiencing similar situations. It's also important to remember that seeking help is a sign of strength, not weakness. If you've been affected by this situation, please know that you're not alone. Reach out to your doctor, a trusted friend or family member, or a support service like Lifeline. Your voice matters, and your experience could prevent others from going through the same thing. By speaking up, we can create a culture of transparency and accountability, ensuring that everyone has access to safe and ethical cosmetic practices. Touch the nerd. Section seven, choosing safety, navigating the world of cosmetic procedures. The desire to look and feel our best is completely understandable, but it's vital to remember that our health and well-being should never be compromised in the pursuit of aesthetic goals. The cosmetic industry is largely unregulated, making it even more important to be vigilant about choosing qualified and reputable practitioners. Don't be swayed by flashy advertising or promises of miracle results. Instead, Focus on finding experienced and qualified professionals who prioritize safety and ethical practices. Remember, cheaper isn't always better, especially when it comes to your health. Ask for recommendations from trusted sources, read online reviews, and schedule consultations with several providers before making a decision. It's your body, your health, and your choice. Choose wisely. Hag Section 8 Beyond Fresh Cosmetic Clinic A wider lens on health regulations The incident at Fresh Cosmetic Clinic raises serious questions about the adequacy of current regulations in the cosmetic industry. Are we doing enough to protect consumers from unscrupulous operators? Are the penalties for breaches severe enough to deter unethical practices? It's time for a broader conversation about strengthening regulations and oversight within the beauty and cosmetic industry. This includes ensuring that all practitioners are properly qualified and registered, that clinics adhere to strict hygiene and infection control protocols, and that consumers have access to clear and accurate information about the risks and benefits of different procedures. This is not just about aesthetics, it's about public health and safety. By demanding higher standards and greater accountability, we can help create a safer and more ethical environment for everyone. Chat, section nine, a call to action. Knowledge is power, get informed and get tested. Tonight, we leave you with a call to action. First and foremost, if you or someone you know has been a client at Fresh Cosmetic Clinic, please seek immediate medical advice and testing. Your health is paramount. Secondly, let's use this as an opportunity to start a conversation about safety and ethical practices in the cosmetic industry. Share this information with your friends, family, and on social media, the more awareness we raise, 
the better equipped we are to protect ourselves and others. Together, we can demand better, safer practices and hold those who prioritize profit over people accountable for their actions. Thank you for watching and stay safe.